If you're like me, the Halo series is something you don't go more than a few days without thinking about. In my opinion, there is no better role model on this earth or off this earth than Master Chief. He taught me almost everything I know about love, war, and aliens. This video is going to be about the Halo style loadout I've been using recently, first out of necessity and then out of enjoyment. My name is Finest XI, and this is the Halo loadout in Escape from Tarkov. So what do I mean by Halo loadout? Well, one classic Halo combo was the shotgun sniper. It was the cream of the crop, and if anything, the only thing I'd swap out one of those for was a rocket launcher. Since we don't have rocket launchers in Tarkov, we will stick to the shotgun sniper. Now there's obviously a million ways you could configure a shotgun sniper combo in Tarkov, but I want to share the fairly cheap one that I've been rocking. So let's start with the sniper. The tried and true Mosin is my choice here because it just feels really good to pop some heads with it. It's also cheap as heck to stick the PU scope on it. I know this scope isn't everyone's cup of tea, but it's actually not bad, and at 13k rubles, it is the perfect cheapie. You can still easily take out enemies over 100 meters out with it. Obviously, we're staying unsuppressed to cut costs, but if you want to run a suppressor, go for it. For ammo, the SNB is the highest pen ammo if you're into that. I've been cheaping out with LPS because when you're shooting heads with a Mosin, the ammo really doesn't matter all that much. Again, go with what you want here. Now the shoddy. I love the MP153, because it fires as fast as you can pull the trigger. Cut the pride and stick the 8 round barrel on it, you'll thank me later. Also grab a Kiba Arms International SPRM mount so you can put a sight on. Now I know this is totally personal opinion for sights, but the EOTech XPS3-0 holographic sight lets you get a great visual on your enemy. It sits high enough that you have full vision and I highly recommend it. It's the one you're seeing now used in this clip. Next, we have the option of suppressing. I go with the ME cylinder muzzle adapter and the Hexagon 12K suppressor. It's cheap enough if you can buy it from Prapper. If you like your shotguns loud and proud, go ahead, be my guest. It'll save you some money as well. For ammo, again, we have a lot of differing options here, but I'll tell you my personal choice is the AP-20 slug. It hits like a truck and shoots right where you aim it. For honorable mentions, I'm gonna say the Magnum Buckshot from Jaeger level two is also a fun option. To clarify, the slug is one one bullet that travels where you aim it while buckshot is a spread of eight or so pellets. Just wanted to throw that in there in case you guys didn't know the difference because there is one. The magnum buckshot is a deadly leg slash face meta ammo and would be a great choice but personally I run the AP20 slugs to each their own. Now a little backstory here about this loadout. Recently I reset my account thanks to hitting the donation goal I had set to help pay for my honeymoon. Thanks chat. By the way I should mention that I do stream on Twitch if you guys are ever interested in hanging out or if you need any help with Tarkov then come stop by. Anyway I've been going through and doing all the tasks again and I've been doing a ton of stuff needing the Mosin and shotgun. I decided to get two birds stoned at the same time and just run both together in every raid. I've been pretty much doing this for a week now and honestly it's just become a super enjoyable loadout. It's not very meta and it does take a little skill to make work but when you get kills with either this Mosin or shotgun you feel great. I highly recommend giving it a shot and seeing for yourself why I've been running this so much. If you guys enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor and hit that like button for me. If you want more helpful Escape from Tarkov content, then hit that subscribe button while you're at it. I love Halo and I have for a very long time and I love Tarkov, so I thought it would be fun to do a video like this and just do a throwback and pay homage to a really cool game and a really cool combo in that game. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I do appreciate y'all checking out the channel and as always, have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one.